This week on People in the News, we have not one, not two, but three major events for your viewing pleasure. You are welcome to People in the News, where we connect you to every event happening in Nigeria. I am Lucy Ohiri. Remember the saying, you are addressed the way you are addressed. Well, there is a beautiful woman making sure that you are addressed properly. We start off this week talking fashion with the grand opening of the luxury store of Bukola Faliki called Chic and Style. Now, this ceremony was screaming class. And here are the highlights. If sophistication were a place, it would be this building. If luxury were to be represented, it would be inside this edifice. What more can represent such magnificent works than this business empire owned by Pukola Faleke, wife of the lawmaker representing Ikeja Federal Constituency, James Abiodun Faleke. Mrs. Faleke has once again taken her love for fashion to another height with the opening of a tastefully built and furnished sixth floor upscale fashion hub named Chic and Style. It is located on the very busy Ogunusi Road, opposite Omole Phase 1 in Lagos State. Mrs. Faleke had been a sophisticated fashionista from her heyday. She's known for indulging in beauty pageants and also facial advertisements for top brands before coming in contact with her husband. Friends, family, and well-wishers are gathered here to witness this epoch-making ceremony. The entrance of the wife of the Deputy Governor of Lagos State, Oluremi Hamzat, signaled the start of the event. She punctuated her entrance with some dance steps while the band dished out tunes to her delight. As the event started, the pastor, quoting from the Bible, praised the family for this initiative praying that no harm would befall the business. According to Lamentation chapter 21 to 23, it is by the mercy of God that we are not being consumed. In Romans chapter 9, verse 15 to 16, the scripture says, I will have mercy on whom I will have mercy, and I will have compassion on whom I will have compassion. We gather here today to give thanks to God for who he is. The Bible says when you take God out of a man, when you take God out of a woman, that person is nobody. When you take God out of a business, that business, it will not flourish. My prayer for sheep and star and everything that will come upon this building, the blessings of God will be upon it in the name of Jesus. The wife of the deputy governor, Olura Mihamzad, in her speech noted that the building oozes class and allure. Thanking the Falikes for opening this fashion store was top female and children apparel in store for purchase. As we gather here today, let us continually celebrate and support this great achievement attained by my darling sister and our team. Encourage her and with our substance and spreading information on the existence of this business outlet to our families, friends, neighbors, and society at large. To my darling sister, I admonish that the temple of all that hard work that you are known for, the current moment of success attained, and the opportunities that lie in the future to be continually safeguarded with all your passion and commitment. And we pray that the Almighty God will continue to strengthen you so that you'll be able to do more than what you even think you will be able to do. Thereafter, the wife of the Lagos State Deputy Governor 
proceeded to cut the golden ribbon to declare the place open for proper business. In the name of the Father, Amen. the Son, Amen. and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. This opens the way for everyone to catch a glimpse of the store's offering as well as shop all the ones. Friends, family and well-wishers automatically turned customers as they shopped luxury items which tickled their fancy. We're actually here today to celebrate me, to celebrate the works of my hand, to celebrate my business, Chicken Style. Chicken Style has been in existence for a while now. And um, we've been everywhere, but I guess it's God's time and it's about time that we have what we call has, our property, our main place to showcase our business, to showcase what I do, to showcase my goods, all luxury, all Italian brands. Chicken style um, comprises of so many things. We got shoes, we got bags, we got wares, we got everything called beauty and fashion. And what we're actually doing today is not just chicken style. My kids, my daughters are also coming into the business, introducing them into the business. So we are also giving birth to the name called Neturi by ESI. That's Neturi. ESI means Elizabeth, Sarah, and Ife Olua. My take is to appreciate God for her, for what God has done in her life, in her business life, and of course in her family. Uh, without a peaceful home, this will not happen. Uh, I want to appreciate God. I also want to thank her for being hardworking. Uh, I, allow, I allow her to do her work, to do her business. Is she's a, she's a very hardworking woman. She, as you see her, when she travels out to 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 shop, you won't believe that she's the one. While she opened the luxury fashion hub, TVC News also gathered that Mrs. Bukola Faleke dedicated some parts for her children to sell kiddies' outfits, which makes it a complete fashion hub for not only women, but for kids as well as young adults.